We talked about uh, you know the Coquihalla. Yes. I, I guess the I'm trying to think. Allison Pass, what 1,300 meters? Coquihalla, mm -hmm. 16 to 1,800 around the the passes. I got to double check my math, but uh, same elevation as many of the ski slopes, and you'll be impressed by how much snow they've had. Your snow report brought to you by Worcester Blackcomb, and again, 29 centimeters in the last 24 hours for Worcester and Blackcomb. We kind of threw a number out there and said 30. Well, it turned out to be awfully close to that. Minus 12, mostly cloudy right now. 230 centimeters your total snowpack, and that's measured at Mid Mountain. So for today, I think you'll get a bit of a break in the action. But there is that one more weather system coming tonight, adding maybe 8 to 10 centimeters to the slopes of Worcester and Blackcomb, and then it clears. So lots of sun over the hills for Thursday afternoon, Friday, and Saturday, and a blanket of new snow to enjoy. So for the local hills, yeah, lots of snow. How about 34 centimeters on Seymour since this time yesterday? It's minus 3. It's mostly cloudy. The pattern's going to dry out during the day today with more snow coming tonight. And for Cypress, reporting 18 centimeters of new snow. Now that snowpack I measured at Mid Mountain is up to 245 centimeters. Is really getting going here late in the winter season. Minus two, mostly cloudy, staying sub zero all day, and fresh snow comes tonight. Grouse Mountain reporting 23 centimeters of new snow. It's minus three right now on the island, still doing great for Mount Washington as well. Getting a late surge here for the second half of winter, 14 centimeters, bringing your snowpack up to 200. And the uh, Mid Mountain uh, Station reporting minus seven right now, partly cloudy conditions. It's definitely cold enough for more snow to fall on all the ski hills during the night as we get more cold rain around here. Now, today, that chance of precipitation is very small. We'll get some breaks of sunshine instead. Not a bad day. Uh, rain tonight, a little slushy at times. Clearing tomorrow with a big blast of wind. And then not as windy Friday nor Saturday, but the sun comes out. Frosty morning, sunny days, about 6 degrees. And a small chance of a shower kind of sneaking into your Sunday forecast. Riaz, what do you think of all that stuff?